Today we are going to take a look at my favorite variation of the rainbow, which is called Advanced Rainbow. Or like some are used to call it, the complicated rainbow from the FIFA game. In a classic version, to perform the trick, you should push the ball with your foot. It may cause difficulties for beginners to lift the ball to a necessary height. From the other hand, in an advanced version, we kick the ball with a heel. This allows us to send the ball higher and farther with less efforts. So, let's start. The key thing in this trick is a flick up. Non-standard way to lift the ball. Let's take a look at it separately. Step 1. Place your weak foot on the left of the ball. But not too close. Next, with the sole of your strong foot, roll the ball towards the inside of your weak foot. Make the ball go up by lifting the inside of the foot. The ball should hit the spot which is called the metatarsis and which is located here. Step number 3. Switch your standing legs and right at the moment when the ball touches the metatarsis, lift your weak foot. Thus, you get a flick up. When my students were making the first steps in mastering the trick, I noticed that many of them confused this flick up with another similar one. Here's the wrong version. As you may have noticed, here's no step over. Standing foot remains the same. And in the correct version, we have a step over. Okay, we are done with the flea cup part. Let's move on to the heel kick. It's not enough just to get your leg up. You have to feel the ball, be able to send it in the needed direction. For that, there is an exercise. Heel juggling. The more you juggle, the better. But let's still set the minimum number. Let it be the number that my student Victor can do. He hasn't practiced hill juggling separately, therefore it will be fair. Okay, let's leave it like that. That was good enough. Three times is a minimal number you should be able to do. After that, it will not be difficult to merge these two moves together but we still have to learn how to do the trick in the move. Here you have to place your weak foot in front of the ball, not on the side of it like we did in the beginning. The ball will fly up and a bit towards the opponent by inertia. That's the end of the theory part, let's move on to practice. And the lesson is over, guys. Now I want to ask Victor a question. Look, you've just mastered the new trick. Are you gonna perform it in real games? Well, since I've learned it just a couple of days ago, no, I think I can't use it so far. I guess when I will be able to do it 9 times out of 10, only then I will start using it. That makes sense. I strongly recommend you to listen to these words. Because first things first. You have to get the trick to stability to use it in real games. At the same time, we've just proved that this trick is quite easy to master, not so difficult as it looks. And if you enjoyed this video, what do you have to do? Press like? Absolutely! And so that not to miss the most awesome videos about football tricks, subscribe to the channel and ring the bell. Good luck and see you soon!